Okay, so first things first, we need to plug the Radio Master Zorro into our computer via USB. Now, once you've done that, this will message will pop up and you select USB storage. Now, once you've selected that, you'll be able to see the contents of the SD card inside the Radio Master Zorro on your computer. So now that we've got the Radio Master Zorro plugged into the computer, we can open File Explorer. We can actually see down here that we've got a USB drive, which is the SD card. I'm just going to place that over there. Now, the next thing we need to do is open your web browser and go to this address. I'll put a link to that in the description. Now, this is a version of the INAV Lua telemetry script which will run on the Radio Master Zorro. So what we need to do here is right click this zip file and save link as. I'm just gonna save this down to my desktop and click save. That's completed. So now we go down to our desktop. We right click and we extract. And I'll show the files once it's done. That's gonna unzip that folder and now what you can see here is we've got a scripts folder and a widgets folder. So let's just get these two folders up. What you need to do now is highlight these two folders, right click and copy. And then in your SD card on the radio, right click and paste. Now I've actually already done this, but I'm going to replace the files anyway. So now that those folders have been copied onto the SD card, let's move over to the radio. So now that we've copied over those folders, we need to turn on the model, whether that's your quad or your plane, and we need to discover new sensors. To do that, we long press on the model button and we page back to the telemetry screen. Using the jog wheel, we scroll down to discover new Click on that and that's going to go and discover all of the sensors and then we need to press stop. Now we come out of that menu and then from the main screen long press model again and to, in order to add the telemetry screen onto the radio we then need to page back to the display screen uh, and we need to change screen one from nums across to script. Now we come across to the three dotted lines, click on that, and now you've got the INAV script. Select that, and then if we come out and we come back to our main model screen, what we can now do is press this telemetry button, and now we have there it is. Now we have the INAV telemetry on your Radio Master Zorro.